Accurately measuring crankshaft journals is essential to ensuring the correct oil clearance between the friction bearings and the crankshaft when the engine is assembled. Excessive wear causes the journals to become undersized, requiring replacement or regrinding with fitting of undersized bearings. Journals normally wear more on the loaded side versus the non-loaded side. This will cause the journal to become out of round. In your workbooks, you will be required to record measurements for both the main and connecting rod journals for size, taper, and out of round. Using a properly calibrated outside micrometer, measure the journals in at least two places 90 degrees apart from each other. Stay away from oil holes and journal fillets. Record your results. On each individual journal, the smallest dimension measured will be your journal size. Compare against the manufacturer specifications. Subtracting the smallest dimension measured from the largest dimension measured will give you the out of round for that journal. A general rule of thumb is that a journal must not be out of round by more than one thousandths of an inch. When measuring journal taper, make separate measurements at the front and the back of the journal in at least two places 90 degrees apart from each other, as shown in the diagrams. Subtracting the smallest dimension at one end of the journal from the largest dimension at the other end of the journal will give you the taper. The general rule for maximum allowable taper is one thousandths of an inch. Follow the same procedures for measuring size, taper, and out of round on the connecting rod journals. Record the results in your workbook.